Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to solve a Python interview question that has been asked for the role of data analyst. So let's understand the problem statement now. So the question is, how do you calculate descriptive statistics for a data frame using pandas? Now, times the interviewer provides you with the sample data and sometimes they don't. So, if in case they have not provided you the sample data, you will have to assume it. But for, for this case, let's say that you have been given the sample data. So, this is the sample data that you have been given. It has columns like age, height, weight and gender. Four columns over here and the values for these columns. So, let's move on to solve this question using pandas and Google columns. So guys, coming to the Google Colab interface, now we must know that to calculate the descriptive statistics for a data frame in Pandas, you need to use the describe method and this method provides you a summary of the statistical measures for each numeric column in the data frame including count, mean, standard deviation, minimum value, maximum value and say 25th percentile, 50th percentile, 75th percentile, all the values like that. Oh, but it is important to note that we will first have to convert our data into a data frame and then on the data frame we can just use the describe function. So let's just do that. So this is the sample data that we have. So now what is that I have to do it? I will just create a data frame of uh, this data. So I'll just run this. Okay, so let's just create a data frame of the above data so I'll just give my data frame name as df and to create the data frame first I'll have to import pandas one second okay import pandas as pd now pd dot data frame sorry data frame bracket it is data so it will just create a data frame so if i just run df it, so you can see that our data frame has been created here now i just want to calculate the descriptive statistics of the above data frame and to do that i will just make use of the describe function so calculate descriptive statistics statistics and to do that I'll just so let's say I'm just writing summary is equal to df dot describe function now if I just run this and if I just display the summary over here you'll be able to see the complete uh, descriptive stats of the above data frame so you can see that uh, this is output a uh, summary table like this so it has it contains values like count mean standard deviation minimum 25th percentile 50th percentile 75th percentile max for each column age height and weight now one thing that you can note here is it has not given given the descriptive stats of the column gender this is because it has only included numerical columns and and it has excluded the non-numeric columns so the non-numeric column in our case is gender so it has just ex excluded that so if in case we want to include that as well we will have to write it something like this since if we just want to include uh, the categorical data as well as well as uh, the continuous data so summary summary one let's say so it has to be df dot describe and in the bracket I will have to write include is equals to all. So what this will do is it will also include the categorical data. So if I just run this and I will just display this here. So here you can see that this is output a summary table that includes statistics for both numeric as well as categorical column uh, that means it has included the gender column over here so in this output for the numeric columns age height 
In weight, you can see the usual descriptive statistics like count, uh, mean, standard deviation, minimum value, 25th percentile, 58th percentile, and 75th percentile, and max value. But for the categorical column that is gender, you can see only the count, unique value, the top value, and the frequency. So this is the only thing that you can see. So the total number of uh, non-null entries are, denotes the count. Unique is nothing but the number of unique values in the column. Now top is the, the most frequent category. And the frequency is the frequency of the most frequent category. So that's how it has just calculated the descriptive stats of the data frame. So I hope you're clear with this question. So you just have to use the describe function overall. So if in case you want to include the categorical columns as well, you can just include the, the describe uh, and in the bracket, you will just have to include is equals to all. So that's how uh, you're just going to approach this problem. So I hope you're clear with this solution. Let's meet in the next video. Thank you.